Hey guys, Cobra here, and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a quick video about how to increase your damage versus kingpins in the Grand Mafia. So I saw that someone had posted a comment asking um, about this particular thing, which is you know how to increase your damage on kingpins, you know, what's the best for them. So I'm just going to do a real quick um, video explaining it. So there's only a few ways to do it. Um, the first way is going to be investments. You're going to go down and it's going to be the kingpin section. You can see the top ones just work with energy, um, allowing you to regen it faster, use less when you attack. But then once you get past kingpins too, you get challenge damage. And you can see down here, I'm currently getting 13.6% extra. If I upgrade it again, I would get 26 more. If I come down here, there's another one, which is also the same thing. Now, if you look at the max, this one will give you 23 and a half. And this one will give you 19%. So those are extra boosts. If you come down here, there's another one, but you have to be even higher. So that's how you're going to increase it the best. You also have the challenge combos. You can see here, max challenge combos plus six. Down here, another three. So that means that when you attack a kingpin, if you just do the single attack, every time you attack it, it's going to get slightly stronger. You're going to deal more damage to it. And that just increases the max limit of how many times that can stack and go up. Now, when you're actually attacking, there's two other ways that you can increase your damage. So the first way is going to be the Challenger set of equipment. This is a premium item. Essentially, you can get it in-game, but you have to earn it through events, and it's very tedious. Easiest way is going to be to purchase it. But, so I, just for the sake of this video, bought the $5 Challenger pack, and I only was able to get two items. One was the Challenger baseball bat, which gives a 4.5% 4 extra challenge damage, and a 5.5% double crate rate, which is very nice. So I'm going to put that on. And then the other one I got was the Challenger's Mask, which gives a little extra movement speed and a little bit extra damage. So we're going to equip that as well. Now, when you go over here, so say this one. Okay. Now, the more damage, uh, the sorry, the stronger your enforcers are, the more damage you're going to deal with one exception so you can see here you'll notice that the ones that it recommends are the ones that i always use you have the ranks and the tiers so you're looking at the top left you can see it goes from you know one star to green two green two stars to blue to blue two stars to blue three stars and then to purple purple is obviously the highest it can go at all and then you've got the different colors of the enforcers. Both of those are going to affect it. So you can see here, one way you can test this is, so right now I'm at 8,085. If I click on her, it goes to 9,792. I unclick her, click on this next one, 11,145. So even though she's a blue, he's higher in the other stuff, so he's going to be better. And then this is the kicker. You've got Lupo. So I'm going to go over to him. You can get him from the Lupo events that come every so often. He's got double crate rate, restorable energy limit, and the last one, kingpin challenge damage. But you have to have him to rank 7 in order to unlock it. But once you get it to rank 7, he will increase the amount of damage you deal significantly. I mean, I've been trying to get him up. That's why I use him. Um... But so you can see, the secret here is, if you don't have time and you hit the challenge times four, it's going to work, but you don't get the bonus. If you hit once, so we'll hit once. Okay, I did 17% damage. Okay, that's not terrible. So, 17% damage. But now when I look at it, you see I've got double crate rate and damage bonus. So I'm going to attack again. It 
Second time, 19.5% damage. That increased two whole percent. We're going to go third time. Twenty-one point six percent. Once again, another two percent increase. So look at that steady increase. So if you're ever trying to take down a really tough one, like a higher level one, what I would recommend is most definitely use. So, um, most definitely use the single attack because it will stack more and more. I almost just killed that with those four attacks. You can see that last one dealt 24.27% damage. So it consistently gets up. And the max, you can see mine goes up to 14 with my research. So those are just the little things that will increase it. Um, so like I said, you can get the equipment either from events or actually buying it. Um, it's going to cost a lot of money if you want to actually get the whole set and upgrade it though. I will warn you of that. Otherwise, work on that research. That'll help a ton. And work on Lupo. If you can get him up, he will also help a ton. I uh, hope this helps. If you have any questions, leave it down below. Please like and subscribe for more videos.